Welcome back to Zachus. I'm so glad you joined me for another video. Today is going to be health related. I don't normally do this type, kind of videos. I normally do things for men, connected home, but I'm deviating a little bit because this channel is all about honest reviews about things I'm trying to help you guys out from my experience. So let's get into it. Here we go. Um, a lot of you have that are subscribers or that have been searching um, found my pill pack video um, I take medicine every month as a lot of you do and um, I needed a way to not just get big bottles that I had to travel with and remember did I take them or because sometimes my days get really crazy and I travel a lot and so I went searching just to give you a little recap you can watch the pill pack video it's right below in the description but I went searching for a way for a company that would separate my meds out in the dosage I need them every day. And so I found PillPack. And they put all your meds in little packs and they even give you a little travel case, which is awesome. And this cool dispenser if you want to pay for it or that comes in a box dispenser. And you just pull them out. Um, you know, I have two a day, so I separate them and lay them out or put them out of pocket, whatever I need to do to make sure I'm getting my meds. And I really got frustrated with them about a couple of months ago. They shifted gears. I don't know what happened. Um, Amazon has owned them for a while, so I don't think that was the issue. But they are owned by Amazon. They started uh, they started sending me different kinds of meds. Like it's the same medicine, but different brands, and it caused a lot of problems. They didn't ask me. They just decided to change my meds suddenly after like a year of giving me the same meds, which was really frustrating. They deleted or got rid of their app, which I really loved their app. It reminded me and I could track my meds. I could contact them really easily. I could pull it up really quick and see what my meds were for my doctor, things like that. I don't know why they decided to get rid of their app. It was very, very convenient and very um, much one of the reasons I recommended them and use them. So with all that said, I got frustrated and I went looking again because I thought by now probably they had some competitors and sure enough, I found CVS Simple Dose. And they do the packets the same way. I can still use my dispenser. Um, and they DV, you know, will divvy it up any way you want to. But I'll tell you first what I liked about them. I could easily get my meds um, through a CVS pharmacy instead of having to have them shipped. So I could run to my local pharmacy if I had some um, as needed meds and get them or an emergency or traveling. Um, the packets were the same, um, the copays were the same, all that kind of stuff. So it just seemed really simple, simple dose. It seemed really easy to just switch over. So I got my first pack and I realized my meds were not what I said. And I called them four times to go over that I had to have a certain brand, that I had to, you know, have this certain kind of meds. And come to find out, they don't even carry that brand. And so, I went two weeks on backup meds. Thankfully, I had some backup meds um, because I had I'd run out and I couldn't use theirs because I couldn't get a refund if I used any of them. It was a huge mess. So, long story short, I went back to PillPack because they had the brand I needed and the customer service on CVS Simple Dose was was good but not great. They didn't have the power to make decisions. And it seemed like there was this huge disconnect between the stores, the local pharmacies, and Simple Dose. They're not connected or communicating well. If the store had a med, CVS Dose couldn't see it. They had to like transfer it like it was a separate company and stuff, which was really frustrating to me. And so I ended up going back to PillPack because I just, I got frustrated. And, and I thought... Out of the two, I'm less frustrated right now at PillPack. They have the brand I want, and the customer service was really impeccable. They got me right back up and running, got my meds out to me as soon as um, they could clear everything through CVS. So they were super on top of things, super nice, super easy to get in touch with. And um, I do like the new website for PillPack. It's easy to chat with somebody and get, get information. The customer service level, I can tell, has risen up. Um, it's gotten better, so they've worked out some of those kinks. Maybe Amazon's come in there and kind of help them with that stuff. But I just wanted to do a quick video. A lot of you have commented on my pill pack video, and I've told you some of my frustrations. And so I went through this whole thing over July and this month, August, 
and I'm finally back on pill pack and getting everything situated. Um, and on top of all this, I changed insurance during all this, so it was just a huge debacle. Um, and I'm now with pill pack, and I'm going to stay with pill pack um, just because it's just. In spite of all the frustration I had with them and the, and the, um, just kind of like frustrated by them getting rid of stuff and changing things that I didn't think were necessary. Um, they still are a great company. They still are giving me my meds on time and they're quick to get things to you. And CVS just wasn't. CVS, um, even though customer service was mostly nice, um, it was just very difficult to deal with them. It took three days and several phone calls just to figure out that I wanted a certain brand that the doctor prescribed a certain brand and put on there it has to be this brand and then they it took them another 48 hours to figure out they don't have that brand and then it took them another 48 hours to figure out he's not going to pay for meds he doesn't need or can't use so how do we get these back and then I took them back to the store and they were supposed to reverse it that day but it took another week for them to reverse it out it was just a huge mess. I still don't have a refund from them, by the way. So I'm still dealing with that after a month. And um, it's just super frustrating. So I wanted to do this video for you guys. I wanted you to know so you could make a better decision for you. Maybe you've had a great experience with Simple Dose. Comment below. Check out PillPack, but all the links are down below to both of these so you can check them out yourself. And if you're not a subscriber, hit that subscribe button. It's free to do so. Cancel at any time. You'll be notified first when I put up videos. I would love you to become part of the Zakas family. Thank you to all my subscribers. It's great to see your beautiful faces. I will catch you guys in the next Zakas video. Give this video a great thumbs up if you like it. I appreciate it. Have a great day. Peace.